Hey guys, this is Game Guardians Genes here. Welcome back to the Campaign Craze. Last time, we started our project on DuckTales Remastered on the Xbox 360, and now we're back to continue to the next level, before we covered the Money Bin and the Amazon. Now, the next adventure we are going to Transylvania. This is where be uh, rumored where the... I can't speak. Vampire back, is. Boys. We're <laughs> off to Transylvania, and we're no coming back without the coin of the Lost Realm. When I say vampire, I mean like Count Dracula, etc., etc. Well, that's where it technically is supposed to be. In this game, wise at least. This is it, kids. Draculesti Manor. Home of the legendary Drake Von Vladstone, heir to the coin of the Lost Realm. Boy, it's kind of creepy out here, isn't it? Uh, uh, Uncle Scrooge, we're not going to break into this guy's house, are we? Yeah, of course not, Louis. This castle has been abandoned for centuries. Hey, look at this. The Junior Woodchuck Guidebook says Drake Von Vladstone was best known by his nickname, Count Dracula Duck. Uh, is there really a monster in there, Uncle Scrooge? Ah, uh, don't be silly, Webby. Yeah, there's no such thing as Dracula. Right! Ah, uh, he is right, isn't he, Uncle Scrooge? Uh, of course he is, Louis. Vampires, banshees, and mischievous spirits are just a lot of superstitious hocus-pocus. Believe in the cult. Join me, my fellow brethren. But you better stick close to me, just in case. Okay, so... Whoa, would you like to <laughs> bounce on a bridge like that? Let's go back real quick, because if I remember... Remember? Remember? remember the, uh, there's like a couple of these diamonds. Yeah, okay, there was. I think maybe one more. Ah, uh, all these small ones. Okay, so our goal now is to get to the Coin of the Lost Realm. And as before... Our main character is Scrooge McDuck, Donald Duck's uncle, and the great uncle of Huey, Dewey, and Louie. Now you boys stay put, and keep an eye on Wee Webigale. I'll be back with the treasure in no time. Aw, nuts! We want to come with you, Uncle Scrooge! Do not worry. I'll be back with the coin before you can say E Pluribus Unum. E Purple Bus Whoom? Yeah, I'm not sure that's as fast as you think it is. Besides, why should we have to stay here just because Webby's a big chicken? Yeah! Oh, we're not afraid of... Oh, whatever's hiding out there, uh, are we? You boys are so mean! I'll show you who's not afraid of the dark... Wait, Wait Webby! Webby! Oh, no! Huey! Dewey! Louie! Will they be all right, Uncle Scrooge? Of course. Everything will be fine, my darling. Wait here, and I'll be back with the lads lickety-split. Yeah, because it's great of a uncle to uh, leave a baby girl like her all by herself. The enemies in this area are so annoying, I swear. We have the skeletons, and we have like the mummy guys. Ugh, they gave me hell on the screen. Come on. Damn it, what was the way? So, right, right, down, okay. So, there's basically a simple method, or like, or should I say, not simple, but like a fast way of doing all of this. But, my personal preference is to go in this order. Since we have the dot next to us, and then the dot in the bottom right, there should be a mirror take us from that zone to uh, where our origination will be, and then we can work our way to the top. <laughs> it's easier to just visualize. Uncle Scrooge, help! Uh, if you haven't figured it out already, these guys, these are like our little mini bosses, and uh, they're pretty easy to beat. Yo! I'm out of here! Hey! That wasn't a ghost at all! It was a beagle boy in disguise! Trying to beat me to my treasure, no doubt. 
But it'll take more than just an old bed sheet and flower dust to frighten off Scrooge McDuck. Look, Uncle Scrooge, that Beagle Boy dropped something. It's an old piece of paper. Twist me, Tartan. It's an ancient rune. You mean like a magic spell? Aye, lad. At least part of one. Gee, I wonder who tore it into pieces. We'll worry about that later. Right now, I want you to head to the front door and wait for me. I'll be back once I've found the treasure. Off you go, lad. Okay, to the next duck. Oh, uh, let's go here. Nice to get these crystals, by the way. You know, I have no use for the money whatsoever. <laughs> but it's cool to check out the money bin. Or, not the money bin. The vault. All the way filled up. So, versus the Amazon and uh, the money bin itself, the the way that we can we're gonna tackle uh, Transylvania is there are certain parts where the a mine card is, and just um, later on when we do the mine shaft, this will have a cart system where we're gonna have to jump down, left, up, etc. And it's it's really cool, but it's really hard because you have to jump at the right moment with the cart and out of it as well. Was there anything up here? Nope. And that's good. good. Alright, our next boss should be here. Maybe it's a little further. Oh, uh, only an ice cream. Here we go. Yeah. Hey, Do we? Ah, the Scrooge! Get me down from here! I wonder which big old boy this one is. Based on the size and the sound, um, I think it's burger. Yeah, it is. I guess you found me out. Oh well, you guys got any lunch? No! Okay, okay! You don't gotta be all touchy about it. See ya! Aw, oh, that guy gives me the heebie-jeebies. He was starting to look at me like I was lunch. Well, next time he'll think twice before scrapping with Scrooge McDuck. Speaking of scraps, he dropped this out good Scrooge. Ah, it looks like another piece of that torn up sorcery. Ah, uh, say what? A magic spell. And it's nearly complete. Just one piece left to find. If only I knew where to start looking. Well, that bungle boy did say this house has an illusion wall. Uh, do you think he meant... Of course, a secret passage. Oh, no wonder I've been having so much trouble finding anything around here. Good lad. Now, off you go. I need you to wait at the entrance with the others. Okay. Scrooge McDuck is always my favorite character, Disney character. He's th he is so cool. Alright. Oh, damn it. I was so close. It was just more chess or chess. Okay, we took the mirror back. Now, to, uh, let's see, we had Huey, Louie. No, we need to go save Louie. He's the the green one, I believe. Uh, okay, so the item is there. Two ways of attacking these mum mummy ducks, whatever. You can uh, hit their chains at them, or you can uh, just bounce on their heads. It's always easy to just bounce on their heads. Ow, ow, ow. But sometimes it calls for the situation. Oh, it's going to be a collateral damage. Haha. <laughs> like I don't think this is an extra... Oh, it is an extra heart. Okay, so on easy, it's all the hidden chests are going to be... Uh, well, not so hidden, it's on the map. So it's, uh, but it's going to be all hearts to give us more lives. However, if we're doing something like medium or hard, then it's going to give us... 
maybe not medium. But it'll give us medals, it'll give us just extra treasures worth to help our modifier give us more cash. Straight to the million. And in the minecart, we can only just duck and jump and pray for the best that we don't fall. Like that. Crap. But we have unlimited lives. Now if it was harder, oh, then we have limited lives. Which is cool because the birthday cakes look exactly like Scrooge McDuck instead of just normal cakes. Get hit while I'm at it. And we'll help. Ooh. Easy is nice and relaxing. We can enjoy the story. We don't have to worry too much about the hard gameplay. Louis! Let's see which one is. Uh, big time? Yeah, it's big time. That's a tough without your army helmet, eh? <laughs> oh, Only the gang in Sing Sing finds out you were knocked flat by an old guy in his cane. <laughs> yeah, thank you, lad. Yeah? Well, you better be careful where you go poking around, McDuck, or you's gonna have much bigger problems than me. So long! Now, what do you suppose he meant by that? Ah, oh, it doesn't matter. Uh, quick, lad, see if there's a scrap of paper lying about. Uh, you mean like this one, Uncle Scrooge? Exactly. This is the last piece of the riddle. Uh, what to do? That's what I'm about to find out. Quick, lad, go meet Webby and the others at the entrance. And all of you, stay put. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> You should all know that once your parents or an authority tell you something, you should always do the opposite. <laughs> no, don't do the opposite or you'll get in trouble. I have to put- I have to hold left too. I forgot about that the first time I fell. Because if I don't, I'm just gonna jump for it and fall to my death. Woohoo! See if we can break a million via diamonds. Dang, I meant to take the lower path. That gives you a lot more cash. I really don't feel like free falling in, trusting myself. Ah! Mr. Bigley, now where did you come from? Why, from home, of course. I had to be sure you were all right in this filthy place. Marvelous job as usual, Mrs. Beakley. Oh, why can't you take up golf like a normal tycoon? <laughs> I knew it. Yeah, he owns businesses like this now tomorrow. One billion one, one billion two. Okay, chests like these, this is where... Uh, <laughs> It's time to play a little bit of golf. And four. I don't feel like doing too much. Yeah, I was gonna mess everything with that. Uh, okay, so right here, so I can easily just fall down then. Come on, go down. There we go. I'd keep continually right, but I'm too lazy. Oh, I mean, not right, left. Ah, uh, damn it. Here we go. That was just taking me right back to the left, I think. Alright, we are closing to the finale. Watch this. Part of the spell matches the inscriptions on this mirror. Luck of the ducks! I solved the riddle! What riddle, Luck of Scrooge? Boys, I thought I told you to stay with Webby. 
They did stay with me, Uncle Scrooge. I'm right here. Oh, what a pretty mirror. Aye, lass. And if I'm right, using this spell will reveal the foul perpetrator behind all these shenanigans. You could dispel. Ugh, I should have known you'd be behind this. Oh, Scroogey, my old friend. You wouldn't believe how much fun it is watching you run around making a fool of yourself. What? <laughs> oh, you really don't think you need ancient sorcery to find Coin of Lost Realm, do you? No. I had Beetle Boy's hide paper scraps to throw you off trail. Why, you sneaky, conniving... Please, save compliments for garden party. What garden party? The one I will throw in celebration when I get home with Lost Coin. So long, fools! <laughs> Gee, she is a very nice. You said it, Webby. All right, you kids stay here. I'm going to track down that witch and give her a piece of my mind. She got a couple so... Cu couple so's? couple episodes, five minutes, uh, in the series. She's basically just one of those pain in the ass enemies that are trying to go for Scrooge Mc... Uh, uh, Scrooge? Yeah. Um, uh, McDuck's, um, first coin. Back when he, uh, when he migrated, or his father migrated to, uh, basically, I think, uh, Duckburg is like a representation of New York. And... He got his first coin when working there, and so he's been having Scrooge, fortune ever why since. Must you always meddle? That coin is mine. And like the other boss, she uh the Amazon. She takes a couple hits. There are multiple parts to her boss battle. There's the uh freaking lava lasers or whatever that keep popping up. And then she'll be in the mirror, if we can hit her. And then we have uh, her in the bird form. And... Uh, uh, what? Uh, it's the big game. Uh, that part always screws me up. This one's easy. Uh, not. Easy. Damn it! Oh god. Uh, this is making me look horrible. I apologize. Magic of the spell is always so annoying. No, I. I that should have counted. Shoot your damn lasers. Who cares about you? And think of it as a cycle. There's I, three or four cycles. It, once you get to the lava area, uh, every time you hit the like, fire, lava, whatever it is, uh, spires, basically uh, that's one whole cycle. Full of just knocking her out one by one by one. The mirrors is the easiest. If, you, uh, if you're not paying attention to her in a mirror, uh, her picture will disappear, and then you gotta find her, but if you don't get it in time, she will um, shatter her mirrors and then come hit you. Last these inferior mirror and beam spells. It's the last time I shop for spell ingredients at this discount store. You haven't seen lots of magic of the spell. You may have coin of lost realm, but your number one dime will soon be mine. <laughs> Yay, Uncle Scrooge! Mine. Stage clear. <laughs> Man, I'm such a pro. I don't even impress myself. Yeah, I impress myself. Whatever, how that goes. Forgive me. Well. I think that pretty much covers that. Yeah, yeah. So here are our results for Transylvania. 
And we did break a million, so that was the goal. Do you think Magica will keep out of our way now, Uncle Scrooge? It's hard to say, lad. Folks like her have a way of popping up at the most inconvenient moments. Well, when it comes to Magica, there's no such thing as a convenient moment. Too true, Louie. Now then, we're two next lads. We're going nowhere, because that's pretty much it for the time we have. This time for Transylvania, we will end it on... The vault. Woohoo! So, and see, our coin is already here, and we're spitting out cash. I'll see you guys next time on DuckTales Remastered Campaign Craze.